Welcome back. Now that your tempeh is ready, it's time to list it on Lemon Squeezy. Lemon Squeezy is not the only platform to list your templates. There are other options like Gumroad, but we find Lemon Squeezy to be the best option for us. There are a couple of things you should be doing when listing your template online. So in this video, I'll be showing you the behind the scenes of Lemon Squeezy for our template store. Here we're on the product listing page of our template. And we start off with the name Tantify. We've kept this short to meet Framers Marketplace requirements. Next up, we have the description. And the first thing you'll notice is the call to action to preview the template. Remember, the template will always speak and sell for itself. So whenever you're promoting your template, make sure you have the link to preview it. This is then followed by a detailed description that could be used when uploading the template on the Framer Marketplace. Next, we have the list of pages that are included in the template. Now, this is optional, but we've included an exclusive offer for the customer. But the last and most important point is the refund policy. We've also added in a way for the customer to reach out for us if they're dissatisfied. Remember, the first priority is always ensuring a great customer experience. So let them reach out to you. The next section is the media. We've only uploaded one image, but you can add up to 10. And since the aspect ratio is the same over here, as it is when uploading on the Frame and Marketplace, you don't need to create new assets completely. You can reuse the same one. Next up, we have variants. We've only added one, where we've labeled it as standard license. Feel free to add as many as you want. Be creative here. For example, you can add a done for you license, where you as a designer can charge an additional fee for making changes to the template's design for your customer. We can now scroll down all the way to the confirmation module where we added in a short and sweet message for when the customer purchases your template. The same message is then repeated in the email receipt as well. Lastly, we have the button link, which is your Framer Projects Remix link. That's it for this video. In the next one, we'll cover listing your template on the Framer Marketplace. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.